Meteorologist Amanda Papp is here. The latest on now tropical depression 19. It is an area that is of just spin right here. You can see with those thunderstorms associated with it. Here's what you need to know. It's moving west right now at 16 miles per hour and because it's a depression, we now have a cone. Now it's going to continue to push and really try to strengthen because of those warm Caribbean waters. But as it strengthens, it's going to really face some not good conditions because it'll push into land. And so as it pushes into Honduras, that means really bad impacts for people that are living along that coast. So they have multiple warnings already. Here's the cone. What we know is that this system now really great news in comparison to yesterday. It's tracking much more over land. So the more time a tropical system spends over land, the weaker it will be. So that is why intensity models have all dropped and they don't show this becoming a hurricane. So that's good news. We can see first landfall along Honduras and second hit landfall somewhere in Mexico over towards portions of Belize, the Yucatan Peninsula. So the system is going to stick there, right? And then it'll try to move in. We have an approaching trough, a cold front that's going to pick this system up and it's going to turn it to the right. But potentially we could see this system just be torn apart by upper level winds. And that would mean just a sloppy rainmaker for us potentially heading into next Wednesday rather than a full fledged tropical system. So I'll continue to monitor those updates, but looking better for today.